How's it going y'all? Today I'm going to show you how to save the Juggernaut outfit in GTA Online. Firstly, you need to own the ballistic equipment, which you can purchase from Warstock Hitch and Carry. But before you can do that, you need to own a bunker, set up a gun running business, and also unlock the ballistic equipment from the research. If you guys don't have this, you can request a friend to do this. You can also join Discord, link in the description below. Next, you will need a vehicle that can push the crate. You can try to use a truck or heavy vehicle, but the easiest way to do this is to use the ramp buggy. In order to purchase one, you will need to own a vehicle warehouse, which you can purchase from your CEO office. To get started, you guys want to go to the Vespucci Mass Store, open up your interaction menu, go to inventory and call up the ballistic equipment. Wait for it to drop. And you want to use your ramp buggy to push the crate kind of like near the mass rack right here. Try to line it up nicely like you see in this video. Then get off your vehicle and go to this corner right here until you see that you can interact with the head store. You want to walk towards the crate. The moment you get it, you want to spam right d-pad. If done correctly, you should see the clothing menu right here and just wait until the menu closes automatically. Once the menu is closed, you want to open up your interaction menu and remove your ballistic equipment. Wait a few seconds until you see that the ballistic equipment is removed. Now you want to open up the interaction menu, go to style and change appearance. You'll need to pay 100k for this, but to get this outfit, I think it's really worth it. In the character creation screen, you want to choose the solid crew color as your crew t-shirt style and then just simply save and exit. Then you want to go to any clothing store, go to tops, then go to sweater, you want to equip the black combat sweater and then you want to back out under utility vest, you want to equip the peach plate carrier. Now you want to save this outfit and then once safe, go to heist coverall and equip any of the last three here with the full suit and the mask and head over to the nearest telescope. I'm just going to use the one at the beach here. You want to go slightly in front of the telescope, run towards the back of it. Once you're about to reach the telescope, you want to spam right d-pad and open up interaction menu at the same time. If done correctly, your character should not look into the telescope. Now you want to equip the previously saved outfit and simply walk away from the telescope. You'll see that the mask is merged. Now head over to the nearest um, clothing store or Vespucci mask store and save the outfit. Once the outfit is saved, you want to open up the pause menu and start the titan of a job. You can start this job on your own. And once in the job, you want to head over to the nearest ammunition store. So in the ammunition store, basically you just want to save the outfit and then open up your phone and leave the job. Back at the free room, you want to go back to the Vespucci mask store with your RAM buggy and call out the ballistic equipment once again. Do the same method, push the crate near the mask store and you want to pick up the crate and spam right d-pad. You'll see the clothing menu and it will close by itself. Once the menu is closed, you just have to remove your ballistic equipment, wait until your juggernaut outfit disappears and head over to your apartment where you can start the heist. Inside of your apartment, you need to make sure that you have the Fleeka job Kuruma ready. You can do this completely solo if you're in a full public session. Simply set matchmaking to open, auto invite and also you want to invite everyone in the session. As you can see how fast it is that people join. If you still need help, you can always join the Discord link in the description below. Before starting the job, make sure you choose play your own outfit. And at the clothing selection screen, you want to choose the outfit that you previously saved. So once you're in the job, you just want to open up your phone and simply leave the job. Now you should be back at free roam. If there's too many people, you can join an invite only session. You'll see that your character is wearing the Juggernaut outfit and then disappear after that. You want to register as a CEO and then enter any vehicle. And then you want to go to CEO management, uh, CEO clothing, go once to the right and once to the left. As you can see now your character is wearing the Juggernaut outfit but without the helmet and mask which you can easily purchase. Go to the nearest mask store, you can save this outfit first and then go to the hat section and purchase the black bulletproof helmet. Then go to the mask section, you can purchase any of the ski masks, but if you want the original, it's the skull tactical ski. You can also change the gloves, it will not affect the outfit. I'm going to simply use the black fingerless gloves because they look great. Simply so save the outfit and there you go, you've now owned the juggernaut outfit. 
permanently in your wardrobe. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you find this video useful, be sure to hit that like and also subscribe to the channel for more future GTA videos. This is Joe and I'll see you next time.